Hey friends, meet my new printer. I am so excited about this new printer. It is a Canon and it's a large format printer printing up to 24 inches wide by however long. I am so excited. I've been wanting one of these forever. Today, my very first project, I'm printing a large picture of my daughter's face. Here it is all printed out. It is huge at uh, 24 by 36 actually. So after I got done printing it, I brought it over to my messy and cluttered desk that I did not clean <laughs> before I started with this project. And I am just trimming up all the extras around her face that I don't actually plan on using for this project. Y'all, this is a game changer for me. I'm so excited. Next, I went down to my um, kitchen because I needed a larger, less cluttered workspace. And I measured a piece of foam board, making sure I bought the correct size. Then I took a little bit of glue and on the back of it just rubbed a whole bunch of glue all over the entire project. I also have a little shrimp coming in. He is trying to get me to buy some sort of weird onesie online of one of his favorite cartoon characters. That's him asking for work <laughs> so I can pay him. Okay, after I got done gluing, I just went and put it back onto my foam core and I just rubbed the um, print onto the foam core. And of course, pushing it down and also discussing how much this onesie is that he is trying to buy online. Um, once I got done doing that, I washed my hands, of course, because I had a lot of glue residue, wiped the print off, and I just grabbed a X-Acto knife. Right here, I am using a piece of crap X-Acto knife that I got at the Dollar Tree. I don't suggest using Dollar Tree X-Acto knives, um, but that's what I'm using today because that's all I had. So I just went around with my cruddy little knife and I took away any excess of horror face that I didn't want. That's what I'm using right now is just going around, making sure that I get every little square inch of things I don't want on there. At some point in time, I got a final product that I was so excited. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to see the finished product of this. I have been dreaming of being able to make these things for years and it's finally here. Okay, after I'm done, I all I did was is I just took a popsicle stick and just kind of squeezed it in between the two layers of foam and 